Michael's Colton's Equipment, and today we're looking at the JCB Electric Teletruck, the 66-40E. It's JCB's first electric Teletruck, and we're one of the first dealerships in the country to get one. We uh, did a little intro teaser video oh, a few months back when it came in. Uh, to be honest, we just got super busy and we're not able to do a follow-up video. This thing sat in our showroom for probably the last two months. Uh, we finally got it out of the showroom, we finally freed up a little time here, and we finally had a little chance to use it even around the lot doing our normal tasks we do with the diesel Teletrucks. And this thing is incredible. Not only does it burn zero diesel or zero propane, it doesn't burn anything, it's electric. Uh, it's incredibly smooth, it's quiet, it's very responsive. It's got some features our diesel ones don't have, um, and it turns super sharp. Um, and the controls are different. This is a new generation of controls, so it's got some, uh, I think, more ergonomic controls to use. It's got air conditioning, it's got heat, uh, it's got fork positioners, it's got side shift. Um, it can lift a lot of weight. The 66 in the model number actually stands for max lifting capacity. If you had two zeros on that, that's 6,600 pounds max lifting capacity. Um, and that's just his max lifting capacity. That's a lot of weight for this little package. You might not think this thing can lift that much. And did I tell you, it extends. I think you already know that. It's a JCB Teletruck, all of them do that. And that's what makes them so awesome around our lot and around a lot of warehouses and operations across the country. Come take a look. So around our dealership, we do a lot of forklifting. We actually have three Teletrucks that we own at this store alone that we just use around the lot. We have two at our other stores. So we have five Teletrucks in total. This is our first electric one. Um, one of the things you may not, you may know with a Teletruck, it can do things normal forklifts can't. And one of the things we do a lot, we're jumping over top of things. Like say we need to set up this tractor, but this tractor's in the way. You might say, yeah, you can go behind, but what if you had a wall there? Let's just pretend you had a wall there. You can't go behind. You'd have to essentially move this one with a traditional forklift to get to that one. Well, I'm gonna show you how cool and easy it is to get to that one. And not just can I reach over top, I got fork positioners on this thing, so I don't have to get out and set the forks. Because a lot of these pallets, believe it or not, are different fork widths. So you constantly have to get out, kick the forks over. It just, if you add up all the time you waste doing that, um, it's a big time savings to have the fork positioners. The one thing it's hard to get used to on this machine, and I've done it a few times, I crank the key over and I'm like, ah, why isn't it starting? Well, because it's electric, you don't hear it start, but it is running. When it beeps like that, it is running. And there's two things you have to do. You have to put the park brake off like that, and then you have to hit the auxiliary lock off like that. Two buttons every time you, you fire it up, essentially or get the juices flowing, you might want to say. And it's live. I'm gonna turn on the air conditioning and shut the door, it's a little warm today. It's so cool, because it's electric, but it does air conditioning. It's got that cool alarm, I actually like that alarm on, um, compared to the annoying beep, beep. It's a little less annoying. But uh, backup alarms are important. You do need them, especially with a machine like this that's really quiet and you can't hear it coming. Um, so right now I'm coming into that pallet. So not only is that quiet to do, but it's something no other forklift can do, and that's reaching over top of something. And with more practice, I can get a little quicker at it and stuff. But and sometimes with the ground level, it is a little hard to get the the forks to line up on both sides. But it would have been a lot harder if I had to go out there and position the forks manually. The fork positioner is a huge lifesaver, and it's something you, if you have a Teletruck that doesn't have that, you can add that. Um, I'm going to look into adding it to the other ones we got here because it is a big time saver. Um, and just the with a normal diesel forklift or a propane forklift, you have to constantly when you're when you're nudging or I call it creeping or if there's other words for it when you when you need to move the forklift slightly forward, you kind of have to rev it up to get it to do it sometimes, or hold your foot on the brake and let off, and it will it's like it's like an automatic transmission in a car. Once you let off the brake, it's going to start going forward. With the electric, 
it's super responsive. You don't have to throttle it up. If you push the pedal to go forward, you're gonna go forward just as much as you pushed. It, it's hard to explain, but it makes it the most smooth forklift I've ever operated because of that one feature. Um, the responsiveness of the electric power to the hydraulic pump, words cannot describe. You might assume the battery's in the back, and you are right, because the battery weighs a lot of weight. And with forklifts, you need a lot of weight in the back because you're gonna be lifting a lot in the front. So it's a counterweight. And it works perfectly on this forklift because the counterweight's in the back where you need the weight. And batteries are heavy. And this has got a lot of battery. Not just a little, quite a bit. And not only are the batteries heavy, this is a cast iron door. And it is really heavy. Very solid. Boom! It's made to do that, by the way. So, what I didn't tell you about, the battery. It's a huge battery, and um, it is made to be charged, of course. You can charge this battery. You can charge it two ways. You can charge it when it's in the machine by unplugging this and hooking the charger to it, which we have the charger, and they're pr the machines are priced on our website with the charger included. Uh, you can plug it in the machine. If you have a lot of these, you can, um, have an extra battery and these batteries are being are made to be switched out in a shift so like you could switch this battery in five minutes um yeah, un by unplugging it and then you come under here and you fork it out with a forklift and you can put a whole new battery in there if you wanted to have one charging while you're doing your shift it's made to uh this forklift's made to battery power last the battery power is made to last an eight hour shift um, we have right now, the, when we charge it and use it around the lot, we can get two to three days, but we don't use it all the time. You know, we're on off, on off. Um, the battery um, longevity is very good so far, and um, it's a lot cheaper than diesel. I just got a call, and we need to go load a customer up with a box blade that he's coming to pick up. The Teletruck, like I said, makes it really easy to move box blades because they swing around and with a normal forklift it would hit the mast all the time. Not with a Teletruck because you can extend out and keep it away from you like a crane. Let's go do it. We're just going to set this down right here. You do still have to get out and put the strap on from time to time, but it's still really easy. If you can turn it around, that'd be good. There we go. I'll put her down. I'll side shift it. Can it fit all the way so we can close the gate maybe? Perfect. Like a glove. We we're filming a commercial for this. <laughs> so it's worked out perfect. I love talking how easy to other dealerships that we talk to on a regular basis. They don't have one of these and it, these are so, these make it so much nicer to load. Oh yeah, to load box blades and wow. yeah. But anyways, you're good to go. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. Have fun with it. All right. Good luck with your surgery too. Yeah. Thanks. You gotta do a victory celebration when you load something that easy. So, if I 
I mentioned, this thing's sweet. And if you want to see it, test drive it, feel it, price it, if you want to buy it, give us a call. It's priced online at scoltonsquipment.com where everything's pictured and priced, including the electric telatruck, including the charger. See you next time.